We were in Australia at a summer camp organized for the most promising football talents in the country. Alongside me were Dennis Law and Ferenc Puskas. George Best recounted the experience down under. As soon as we began playing with the kids, we noticed that some of them had started making fun of Puskas, who was not only considerably older than us, but had also put on a fair bit of weight. At that point, to teach those disrespectful youngsters a lesson, I decided to propose a challenge. 10 shots from the edge of the box with the goal of hitting the crossbar. I asked them who they would like to challenge among the three of us. As I had easily anticipated, they chose Puskas, convinced that they had a good chance of defeating the man who was already well into his years and not in exactly exceptional physical shape. The best of those kids hit the crossbar three times out of ten shots. Then it was Puskas turn. His first nine shots all hit the crossbar. On the tenth shot, Puskas didn't kick immediately. He lifted the ball, juggled it with his head and back, before letting it pass over him with a heel kick. Before the ball touched the ground, he unleashed a true rocket with his left foot, which of course hit the crossbar dead center. At that point, some of the kids, still astonished by what they had witnessed, approached me, asking who that phenomenon was. For you, he's Mr. Ferenc Puskas, George Best, 